look, it's a note. Little outside. Did I change? I did change the game. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. Ooh, we're going to a bar. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is. Excuse me? Okay. Be careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. So, right here? Here's the lock for the window. The code was error, wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Let's try that again. Uh, then it was an O or a zero. Let's see. Success. It worked. The Momo is Momo is at the bar waiting for us. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I want one. You have five kittens? Jesus Christ. I don't want I want one more. I want one more cat and I want a dog. A dog for Jedi. I really don't care for dogs. Like they're cool, but like I said before, like they're too desperate. Mm, too needy. Um, where is the bar? The bar would be, I guess, downstairs. Oh, I know where the bar is. Duh, you was just in there. Mm, let's see. Can I go this way? I can. Hey. Hey, furball. Come here. I managed to get a signal. Fish are underrated pets. Oh, I was going to say something mean, but I'm not a gonna because I was about to say fish people are boring, <laughs> but I'm not going to be mean. Um, oh, what's this music? Let me see if I can get this thing working. <laughs> wow, that was a blast from the past. I've almost got it. Hello, can anybody hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Balthazar? Momo? <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Balthazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Oh, wait, I thought he meant like... Like, get out of here. Like, get out of here, nigga. But no, that was like a sound effect from the, from the computer. <laughs> Uh, yes, we are safe. We found a way up. <laughs> oh, God. Hello, do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers, of course, the sewers, to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Sewers? How? Hello? Darn it, we lost the signal. I can't believe it. Balthazar is alive. He and the others managed to go up through the sewer. So wait, who the hell was in the little library area dead? Questions. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Balthazar made it, there must be a way. Uh-oh. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. They'll make you a, uh, they'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. Doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. His name is Seaman. Oh, it's Seamus. <laughs> um, Seamus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. Oh, it's Seamus? Seamus. I guess, well, I guess that makes sense because Sean, Sean, if you spell your name S-E-A-N, it's Sean, so Seamus would be, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Okay, my bad, job. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test a device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. 
What's up with those numbers on the wall? Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue into uh, Seamus. I keep wanting to say Seamus so bad. There might be a clue in Seamus's apartment. Come on, follow me. Have I been doing all the puzzles? Uh, when I played the first time, yeah. So hopefully it stays that way the second time. I love Momo. And I really want that, uh, whatever shirt that this is. Momo fly as hell. No, the tippy taps of his little feet. The tippy taps. Where are we going, Momo? Come on, Seamus. Open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. That was to be expected. The situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you, I think I have an idea. Oh, breaking and entering. Here, take the doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of... Am I in the way? I'm not. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little out, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communications with the others. All right. Let's steal. Oh, ooh. What are you doing in here? I told you. Getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me beat. Come on, Seamus. Let me scratch on your carpet real quick, though. Wow. Okay, Seamus, here's what we're going to do. Oh, I got to show him the item. Shut, shut, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. I know, I know, I know. Show the item. Um. What's this? Wait, it's my papa's? Oh, wow. I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? That's a good question, Seamus. And now while you find out, I'm going to scratch on your... I can't scratch on your rub! That is cat blasphemy. Ooh. Time will tell. nothing here oh wait you see wait hold on Seamus what do you see time will tell is that some kind of clue you tell me you know your daddy better than I do I'm just a cat now we're uh Seamus you don't know nothing and what was that conversation that we had the other day about how you don't you know your parents but you don't know your parents that well? Seamus is the prime example of not knowing their parents well enough. Well, well, they know their parents well enough. Time will tell. So, oh, clock, clock, duh, clock. Um, time, time. Uh. There's a two, it's two o'clock, five o'clock, one o'clock. What's that red one? That red one's one? Wait, first of all, 16? Time will tell. What do I have to put in and where? I should open the door for old dude. Since he seems like he's the smart one up in here. Um, hmm. I have, I feel like whatever it is, let me knock down this fucking, let me knock this down. Oh, oh, 
Would you look at that? All right, so let me go back to the clocks. So I think the answer is two, five, one, one. I'm, I'm guessing two, five, one, one. Uh, two, five, one, one. Would you, would you look at that? And y'all thought I wasn't gonna be able to do the puzzles. I proved you all wrong. I love proving you all wrong. Makes my day. Uh, <laughs> you see it, puzzle queen? I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints? They must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive about his work. He told me the weapon um, was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside to the slums and he never came back. Oh. Now what should I do? Should I? Oh, let's translate some stuff. What's up, Izzy? Excuse me, what is this? Have you found anything interesting in here? Maybe there's something in here? Why I gotta do looking around? Let's translate. Robots news headlines. Zerks are, uh, are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Sucks to suck. Wait. Did the thing on my back just show me a d hello? Uh, show the item. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find out where he went. I can't believe my Papa might still be alive. I missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zarks, right? Wait, 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 wait. They're gonna give the cat a gun? Like I asked for her, like the last time I played this game, I was like, this cat needs a blicky. We just, <laughs> we just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Y'all, if this cat gets a gun, I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. I am preparing you right now. <laughs> Um, oh, we gotta find somebody in the slums to help us out. Oh, how wonderful. Uh, what about you? Can you help? Oh, uh, you can't help me. Hey, cowboy. That guy is cleaning the paint again. Sure is making use of all that detergent. Hold on, let's see. What's this thing, a tracker? I don't know anything about those high tech stuff. Try the bar. All right, let's go to the bar. Thank you for pointing me in the right direction, Mr. Cowboy Hat Man. Hmm, let's talk to Teddy. Let's see. Bartender might help you find someone who can fix it. Okay, Teddy, I thought that was gonna be you, but apparently not. Uh, let's see. What a beautiful object and rare too. I know a guy who fixes uh, stuff like this. He's very talented, just a little, well, you'll see. His name is Elliot. His office is just left of here, near his grandma's shop. Near grandma's shop. There are signs all over his door, just left of here. All right. So I'm guessing left facing out. So let's go this way. Uh... There's another cat. Oh. Oh. 
I do love knitting. So far, I knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I can make you a poncho. <gasps> do we have electric cable? Oh, no, I need to wait. That is a mighty need. That is a mighty fucking need. I need that electric cable, baby, because we going to get the cat this goddamn poncho. You hear me? So if today is yesterday's tomorrow, tomorrow will be yesterday's today, right? Time is weird. We don't age like our soft one ancestors. We're trapped here forever. Ew, yuck. Uh, so I'm guessing it's down here. Did I pass it? No. He said just left, like... I think I might have passed it. So he said, all right, so I know I'm not tripping. He said, bye, grandma's house or pass grandma house. Cause am confusion. He said to the left of here, bye grandma's. Oh wait, hold on, found it. Never mind. See, I just had to take a pee, y'all. I had pee-pee brain. That's all that was. Hey, how you doing? You're here for Elliot? He's just over there. Oh, I thought you were Elliot. I'm so sorry. Um... Ooh, sheet music. Oh, ooh, not the red light district. Oh. Uh. <laughs> not puzzle queen. Ooh, remember. This tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human, human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. That was, that was sweet. Well, what's, what's over here? Yeah! Let's cause commotion. <gasps> Let's scratch the goddamn rug! Uh, yes yes can i help you oh i gotta show him the thing that rug didn't see it coming <laughs> let's show him the tracker oh wow that's great that's a uh that's a great tracker i recognize this model it's a tom to home tohima 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 br 2000 you could track anyone with this little gadget may i i know how to repair it but when i'm trembling like this i can't use my keyboard i don't know if i'm sick or something but i definitely don't feel right i can't work when i'm shivering like this i need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker so we have to get him a blanket all right so we have to find a blanket what's up with this ominous music you don't have a blanket on your bed where can i find a blanket nester <laughs> Elliot's a hypochondriac. Not many of those are, not many of those anymore. It got passed down from our ancestors. Uh, oh wait. I know how to get cloth. Let me out. We all go to Mima. Me too, Elliot. <laughs> One guy on Twitter said that the game was boring. His poor attempt at making a joke by saying cat can't the cat do kung fu or something he kind of got cooked for that one as he should <gasps> oh guap you want to give me a blanket you want something i want your i want your blanket guap are you no you okay i mean that makes sense i thought y'all you know we're gonna be nice <laughs> Oh, 
Oh no. Oh no. Is this like a series of like, <laughs> do I have to, <laughs> do I have to do like three things in order to get Oh God, side quest time. Now I gotta find an electric, what? How you doing? Look at all the great stuff that falls into our trash. So many treasures. You should go visit the barter man if there's, oh wait. Okay, let's go barter. Where's the barter man? Are you the barter, barter, barter man? I take care of the plants. The humans improved them so much. Now they require very little light. I just add a little bit of water and look how big they get. It's really an amazing uh, technology. That's so sweet of you. All right, let's see who we can trade. That's the guardian. Is this his harem? Oh, oh, they're in, um, never mind. That's not, they're, they're monks. Uh, <laughs> your carpet isn't safe either. Uh, no, you cute. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. All right. What? Oh. <gasps> I don't want to wake him up. All right, we need to find out where we could buy stuff. Where's the barter man? Barter man. Are you over here? Hey, electric cable. Hello, I'm the merchant of the market. You give me something, I give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is a set of electric cable, the best on the market. I'll exchange this for a super spirit detergent. So now I have to find detergent. How wonderful, marvelous, and lovely. People just can't give you things. I'm a cute ass cat. Like if I meow, will you give me things? Oh, he's unbothered. He's unmoved. Let's see, maybe, uh, maybe they should be able to decipher it. It's a very old binary code. You have only a real geek could read this. So maybe we should go back to Momo. Cause I feel like Momo's a fucking nerd, right? Did you find anything at Seamus's? No, but I found this. Damn, you not the real geek, Momo? Gosh darn G Willikers, where am I gonna find detergent? I think I know where to find detergent. in here yep 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 because i'm a genius i was um robot what super spirit <laughs> Uh, what do you want now? I... All right, here's your detergent, funky ass. All right, got the electric cable, baby. Let's go say hi to grandma. Uh, yep, I surely do. Oh, gain a new item. All right, so we have the blanket, and so we can go and give the blanket to the true fucking nerd. The robot Elliot. Where is he? All right. Um, can't work on it until you get a cloth. I'm kind of sad because I thought she was going to make the cat a poncho, but I guess this is fine. 
Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Vacation time. Enjoy and do it. Nothing as you should. If you got a chance to do nothing, do nothing. <laughs> Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks. Now I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. Just got to give it an update and one more thing. Voila. Thank you. There you go, little one. Good luck finding whoever it is you're looking for. No, you. Good luck staying warm. All right. So now we have to go back to Momo. Uh, that's some quite if wait am i all oh, supposed to go back to sheamus right or am i tripping yeah i was supposed to go back to sheamus okay hold on so oh i forgot where sheamus lives wait or am i wait hold on momo Yeah, I forgot where Seamus lives. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, where is Seamus' apartment? I think it's down here. Shut up. Yeah, it's right here. What's up, Seamus? I did manage to fix the tracker. You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. All right, we got a ping. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. All right. all making sense hold on I forgot I have sheet music so I could give it to the person who wants to is this you oh this must be it he really left the slums it's dangerous out there but I must be sure I need to know let's do this all right Seamus not the wired wig. <laughs> the wired wig. <laughs> Seamus, please do not die. He gonna let me go out here by myself, ain't he? Nope, he's not. Look at all these Zerk eggs. They'll eat us, they'll eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. Okay. I'll open the door for you. Trust a small little cat. All right. Time to get. What's up with all these noises? Look how huge this wall is. I remember it was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and in Midtown. <laughs> Not gentrification. That and the fact that they kept throwing down um, their garbage down here. 
What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. You don't say. I don't like this music. I do not like this music. Dead end. Oh God. Oh, no, 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 Not my baby. All right, I gotta go over here and then swing around so I can get, well, God damn. There we go. Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Doc should be nearby. We must be close. Come on. Come on, Denzel. Okay. Whew. I gotta go up here. That was cool. That was intense. You know. Um, go over here and then go over here. Is there nothing over here? Any memories? Nope. Denzel deserves all the treats. Exactly. Denzel over here being fast and furious. <laughs> Cats don't always land on their feet. I'm on cat talk, so I'll be learning shit about, you know, cats and whatnot. And they were like, that's a really big myth. <laughs> so. Cats, honestly, they, they have their moments where they could be graceful, but for the most part, they clumsy. If anybody who owns cats knows that cats can be a little, uh, a little clumsy. All right, so that's the safe haven over there, but I'm just trying to make sure that I'm not m missing anything. No Zerg zone. Yeah. What's over here? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, oh, would you look at that? It's a window. What's up here? It looks like the upside down, right? What even are these? Are they like rats? Murder hamsters? Ew. Oh, it's the docks. 
answer. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, you're not a Zark. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, Seamus, you clever boy. I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my defluxer, but it didn't go as planned. I wish I could go home. I miss my son dearly. You have to look around the house. If, you can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. I could take a look around, but you don't know how to get out. Saving the world. I'm just a cat saving the world, scratching the wall, scratching your rug. Hey. Oh, you're unfazed by the cute meows. Uh. Hmm. Nope, there's nothing in these books. Leave it up to the cat. Bacteria hamsters is crazy if that's the case, right? I've seen humans wear costumes like this. They were small and running around and making a lot of noise. Oh yes, I remember now, they were children. The streets felt much more alive with them. Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he misses Seamus. Is that the same thing? It's like, damn, humans. You just had to go and mess up. Okay, so whatever I need is in here. Can you please? There's, there's obviously something right here. Can you please help me out? Uh, Rick from Rick and Morty. There's obviously something in this room, but what is the obviously something? Hello? You ain't gonna help me? Uh, person whose house this is? It's your house. Hey, be careful with that defluxer. At full charge, it could explode zerks like confetti. <gasps> the blicky! This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work. And the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside this house. The problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew. And with all the Zerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it. I'm not fast enough, but you might just be. If you could reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the deflexor recharged. Come on, follow me. I'll show you what to do. Now it's definitely back to the future references, right? <laughs> That's funny. Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. Thank you. Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some zarks. Once you fix the generator, I should be able to charge and kick start the defluxer. You just need to follow this cable, ch uh, change the fuse, <laughs> and then meet me back here. Best of luck. Follow the cable, change the fuse, meet you back here. All right. Since you got your degree and you know every damn thing, I guess. This is what we'll be doing. Oh, hello. Use item. Oh, I'm gonna have to run back, huh?
to the sweet baby cat. I did a disservice. I will not kill the cat again. Okay. I know which way to go. Get wrecked! Come on now. Get out of here. Get, oh. All right. Well, Y'all really counting? Well, a cat has nine lives. <laughs> and I'm wasting all of them. All right. Amazing. You got the generator back on. Have you seen how powerful the deflexor is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute. I might be able to mount this deflexor to your drone. Y'all, this is so cool. This is different. Yeah, it's a very different game, but it's really cute. Um, and it's actually very fun. I didn't think I was gonna have this much fun playing this game. I just gave it a try because I'm a I'm a cat lady, kinda. I only have two cats. I think you're a cat lady. You're technically classified as a cat lady after three. So, but I'm on the verge of being one. So I was like, ah, a game about cats, something different. Why not? <laughs> it worked. The deflexor is now installed on your fancy drone there. It's not meant to run on off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction. No! Of course we can't get infinite, infinite blicky. Uh, just remember, it's dangerous. Now let's get back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Yes! So I'm coming home, son. I finally got that pack of cigarettes. And I'm bringing home that gallon of milk. <laughs> I told you I was coming back. <laughs> oh! It's gonna be the sound, girl, when it's going down, your body's saying. All right, now how do I enable the blicky? Oh, LB. Yeah! Wow, it's working great. But as I suspected, it can overheat. Let's cool it for a bit. When that happens, I hope it will last until we reach the village. <laughs> We're running up that hill. We're making deals with God. We sure are. Bring your asses out here. This switch doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. Of course. Of course the electricity has been cut. Because why wouldn't it be cut? Where y'all want me to roll this thing? Because apparently y'all want me to roll this thing somewhere. Uh-huh. I see. All right. So... Oh, hold on. Go in. Kitty's got tricks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, keep going. There we go, Denzel. So I really don't want to be on the floor, but I have a gun, so. You thought, you thought, and you thought. Oh, oh, hello, hello. What the? Oh, run, 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 boo, run. Oh, he's dying. He's dying.
little cat dying noises, which is even fucking worse. Just make me feel bad like shit. Oh God, it's overheated. It's overheated. There we go. Get in here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Uh, come on. Can you can you help? Can you do something? Running fast as fuck. God damn. Phew, that was close my ass. <laughs> Let's go back home. Oh. And if I only could make a deal with God and get him to swap our places. Been running up that road. <laughs> I thought it was going to be easier to maneuver, but no. But I feel like once I get used to it, I'll be okay. But Jesus Christ. And those little murder hamster things are fast. And they, like, zigzag. <laughs> I'm mad we're gonna basically call them murder hamsters. What's out here? Ooh. Hey, he made it home! Let's go! You got the pets. He got the the head rubs, the ear scratches. Thanks for saving Doc's little, Doc, little friends. It's great to see that Seamus is no longer alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Momo has been waiting for you by the sewers. Doc and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing together. to him hello you know what thanks to him this music is cute what's up momo you changed your clothes oh that's the benzu momo is waiting for you on his boat you can join him but have you done everything you wanted here because I'll close the door behind you. Don't want Zerks coming through. Did we do everything that we wanted here? I feel like we did. We ain't got time to waste. You really closed that door. <laughs> Thanks to him, sit him back in there with the murder hamsters and see how, how much Seamus helps out right. I can't believe you found Doc and got the defluxer. With this, we could go find Balthazar. Let's go. Okay. I, I got the poncho. I couldn't get the, I couldn't move on without the poncho. And so there was no cat poncho.
can we talk? I'm. This place is creepy. You don't say. What you saying? Oh. I know it got us. Well, the computers ain't got no nose, and cats don't care if it stink. He has to smell all this shit, right? And this is like hundreds of years old shit. You singing? What we gonna do, Momo? I don't see any way to open this gate. Can you take a look on the other side? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Leave it up to me. I see it but I also see nasty stuff also you get can't get too close come here to fool with y'all <clears throat> kitty with the blicky I'm trying to jump back on there we go <laughs> not the motion activated bacteria I didn't think it was gonna blow up well good to know I could like pre-kill them One time I wish the graphics didn't look that good, right? Uh, I've never been this far out of the slums. With you here, I'm not even scared. Oh, look at the baby face! Look at the baby! <laughs> It's crazy that this $30 indie game looks as good as it does. Right. And minimal bugs. Minimal. I, I don't think I've encountered any, like, really bad bugs or any bugs in general. There better be DLC for this with customization. Well, apparently, uh, people are modding this game to make it look like their cats. So, so far, they have, like, a tuxedo cat. They have a gray cat, if I'm not mistaken. I hope they have a, a Siamese cat, because then I'll play, I could play as Boo, which would be really cute. But then I will cry. No, I don't want to play as Boo. I'd rather play as a cat that I don't know nothing about. Because just imagine me sitting up here getting eaten by the murder hamsters every five minutes. I will literally break down and start crying. <laughs> so no thank you. All this old machinery is broken now. I think we could open it manually. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Can I jump over on the other side? Nope. You would love a game like this, but an open world? You just want to exist as a cat? That would be cool. <laughs> Oh, that kind of scared me. Hmm. 
You ain't that strong, Momo. Quick jump down. Oh, it won't hold for long. Oh. Oh, I'm supposed to go down here. I can't go on with you, but I won't stop looking for a way. No! When you find Balthazar and Clementine, tell them I was brave. You're gonna die! Momo, no! God damn it. I don't like all this fleshy noises. These fleshy, moist ass noises. Not tell them I was brave. That sounds like something, somebody's, ah! It's Luska all over again, right. It always comes back to the fleshy prisons. I ain't fooling with, I ain't fooling with you hoes. I ain't come here to fool with you hoes. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let me run. pitter patter feet elden cat the world is in shambles and you will do absolutely nothing about it leisurely play with catnip and chase the red dots with some idiot human who does all the work and relax in the palace after they become an elden lord that was that actually seems like a good idea <laughs> lord what happens if i just run past I didn't think this through. 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 Oh. Leash Capiche did not think this through. She did not think this through. She did not think this through. She did... Okay. Okay. Shh. Everybody hush. Everybody shut up. Cause I know. Oh, it put me where I needed to go. Would you look at that? It said, "Bitch, huh? Here, huh? Damn." <laughs> we know your ass can't. Hello. We know your ass can't see. <laughs> Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Can I jump up here? No, I can't. I love those parts where you have to run away from the f <sighs> spoke too soon i love those parts where you have to run away from the blah 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 god damn it okay y'all can't jump over water ah <sighs> What just happened? Uh... Are those eyes? Ew, what the fuck? Hello? Oh dear. 
I need to figure out where to go because apparently that didn't work. <coughs> well, it worked, but I have to go. I have to go back to where I was. Oh, man, talk about. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You gotta be kidding me! Okay, so I think I know what I have to do. But the question is, how do I get over to the other side? Because apparently I can't jump from right here to the other one because that's too far, which doesn't make any sense, but whatevs. So let me just trial and error this shit. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Run, baby, run, baby. Oh! dark i was alone it felt like i was back in the network but you saved me thank you friend drawing that much power was rough on my core the deflexor is completely destroyed now we'll have to be killed ah, are you kidding me we just got it i can't have nothing <laughs> we literally just got it all right the blicky gone. Uh, still in the sewers. Y'all, this game is so damn beautiful even us with us being in this yucky ass sewer it's still a very hello i can't get in there you too you're not even a chunky boy i was about to say hello 
A traveler from the sewers. We haven't seen one of you in ages. Are you the one who contacted us earlier, the little outsider? Balthazar, the outsider, has been expecting you. He's meditating at the top of our village. Oh. You don't say. So are they on the outside? They put their ussy into this game? You want to get it? I say do it. It's really fun. Even the people talking shit had to admit this game looks great. Right, right? This machine, the scientists I assisted used one of these. He was sick. This was his last hope. He walked into this machine. But I wasn't with him. He was alone. What was he doing? He uploaded himself into the computer and then everything was different. But the upload, something went wrong. He was stuck for hundreds of years until a little cat appeared. Okay. Was it me? I was a scientist. Wait, this is a scientist! I was human. I, I need a moment. <gasps> so this is Dr. BT12? <laughs> That's gonna be its name for now on. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. All right. I'm sorry, I Oh, you don't want to talk to nobody? Oh. That's so s I can't even meet anybody. I guess I have to go talk to uh now I have to go talk to Balthazar. What else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends. What happened to everyone? I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to save? Is this Balthazar? It is Balthazar. No, every time I see a mat that I can scratch, I scratch it. <laughs> What is this? Wait, he's dead? Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during his transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Momo when we received that call earlier. I'm glad I met you. I'm glad to meet you at last, little outsider. You know Momo and Doc, so you already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings me peace. Momo stayed in the slums. I heard you help find Doc and Clementine. She's in Midtown now. If you still want to see the outside, she's the one who could get you there. Apparently she had some kind of plan to leave the city. Here, take this. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. All right. To reach Midtown, climb up our little village. It should be easy for a dexterous one like you, yourself. If you manage to reach the outside, you will be the first. I wish you good luck, but you don't need it. I believe in you. Oh, so he's just meditating. I thought he was dead. I'm sorry for shutting down earlier. Hey! Hey! Okay! like this <laughs> all right i'm human probably the last in the world now look what's left of me so much has come back to me how much have i forgotten maybe if we find clementine we could restore my memories and get you back home at the same time we could go back down and find out more from the companions or head on towards midtown all right damn i didn't know i was have to i was gonna have to climb up up for real you're bored aunt clementine used to hold so these are the kids 
What you doing over here? I have a huge collection of them. Do you want to see? It's still missing some colors, though. I'm missing a yellow plant, a red one, and a purple plant. If only someone small and agile could get them for me. Oh, well. If I see them, I will get them for you, but uh, I'm about to scratch your uh, mat here. And uh, depart. And if I see your plants, I gotcha. I'm gonna keep going up. Um, do 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 do. Damn, this is kind of, this shit's kind of scary. You know what this is reminding me of? Uh, goddamn, what's that goddamn, uh, what's that game me and Baron was playing? Dying, was it Dying Light? It reminds me of Dying Light. It's Tuesday, it is Tuesday. Do I have to run away from murder hamsters? I think I do. And it's sad because I don't have the... I've passed the plants. Oh, well, too late. <laughs> Look, this is a subway station. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation existed. You could ride to anywhere in the city. People used to take it to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning after saying goodbye to my family at home. I remember I was doing this for them, but they're gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see the outside, but does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? We're about to find out. Uh, anyway, we're near Midtown now. Let's find this Clementine. I have a picture of her. We can show it to some of the, of the companions around here. Maybe they'll point us in the right direction. Okay, so you got 44% of your memory. That's good. Is there anything over here? No. I like how you could just do, like, meaningless things, like sit on the chair, jump up on something, go to bed, scratch the damn carpets. Oh, who this? All right. There's so many books here. The Turing Test, The Ethics of Artificial Intelligence. I recognize some of these. Did I have a library? I remember nothing was quite like the smell of books and the turn of a page. I was about to call the robot a fucking nerd, but I'm not going to. It was a feeling almost like comfort. A book was like spending time with someone. Oh, we like books, Leash. I like books too, but not like the smell of the pages and the blah, blah, blah. All right, give me an ebook. <laughs> All right, so you don't know who this is. Hello? What's going on? Not crime. Cooperate or we're gonna have to transfer you to jail and reboot you. Please leave me alone. I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine, I'm sure she's hiding in the res. Oh, Clementine is a criminal. Ooh, this looks so pretty. Yo. Yeah, okay, hold on. Did it save? Two minutes, god damn it. I don't want to do this over again. <laughs> 
at Neocorp, Neco Corp, we work all day long to gather the waste and send it downstairs when where they recycle and repurpose it. Speaking of downstairs, it's been a while since we heard news from them. Uh, first symbol is a street, and then there's a floor and a door number. Should be pretty easy to find. First symbol is the street. Hold on. Okay, so I got to look at my inventory. Uh, street. What did he say? Street, floor, door number. So third floor, right? Oh, oh, y'all. Oh, no. I'm not going to remember this shit. This is giving cyberpunk. <laughs> Street floor door number. You know, where the hell am I supposed to go? All right, y'all, I'm gonna have to call it right here because I'm getting a little sleepy.